The president facing another major deadline, and this could affect everyone. The government runs out of money next Friday. So could there be a government shutdown? After the president recently dined with Chuck Schumer and Nancy Pelosi, what was behind the president's tweet today and their immediate response? And how does it all help avert a shutdown? Here's ABC's chief White House correspondent, Jonathan Carl. It was just a couple of months ago that President Trump was chumming around in the Oval Office with Democratic leaders Chuck Schumer and Nancy Pelosi, striking a temporary spending deal on their terms. A week later, bonding over Chinese food and chocolate cream pie. But today, the president found himself flanked by empty chairs. Pelosi and Schumer boycotting a planned bipartisan sit-down after Trump attacked them on Twitter. Meeting with Chuck and Nancy today about keeping the government open and working. Problem is, they want illegal immigrants flooding into our country unchecked, are weak on crime, and want to substantially raise taxes. I don't see a deal. The president said, I don't see a deal, three hours before our meeting, before he heard anything we had to say. Schumer and Pelosi said thanks, but no thanks. They've been all talk and they've been no action. And now it's even worse. Uh, now it's not even talk. It's a bad time for an impasse. Funding for the government runs out next week, and there's no agreement on the big issues. Defense spending, legal status to the dreamers, the border wall. Do you believe there will be a government shutdown, Mr. President? And would you blame Democrats if that happens? Would you blame that happens, I would absolutely blame the Democrats. All right, John Carl with us live tonight from the White House. And John, President Trump said right there he'll blame the Democrats if there is a government shutdown. Bottom line tonight, John, how likely is it? David, I've covered a lot of these spending battles, and it seems to me there is a high likelihood that this one is heading for a government shutdown. And remember, government funding runs out a week from Friday. David. All right, we're counting. John Carl, thanks to you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.